are you looking around for ways to increase your progesterone and you're really interested in finding out if you can increase progesterone naturally? If you're someone like me, you do love looking into the alternatives rather than having to take medicine, something prescribed, which is actually putting non-natural progesterone into your body. You might have hormone imbalance, perhaps you've been through the trauma of miscarriage, just like I have on my journey. Perhaps you suffer with quite bad PMS and you're just looking into different ways, alternative ways, natural ways to increase your progesterone without having to use creams or pills or birth control. So watch my video and I'll help you with some really great tips to help you boost your progesterone naturally. Hi, I'm Vicky from Oh My Mama Body. I really love helping you to understand your body so that you feel really great about yourself once more. And if you're new to my channel, a really warm welcome here. Thank you for finding me and watching my video. And please do subscribe so you get even more great tips and advice on your journey. Firstly, I guess you've found this video because you already know that you have got low progesterone. Um, it's been picked up because of hormone imbalance or perhaps miscarriage or you've got bad PMS and you're looking into alternative ways to increase progesterone. And the good news is you can look to foods as a starter, really. The type of foods that we eat, especially foods that are rich in vitamin B6 and magnesium, these absolutely wonderful natural boosters for your body to help your body create more progesterone. So vitamin B6 and magnesium can be found in rich, dark, leafy greens, you know, spinach, kale, that kind of thing. Look at brightly coloured red foods like red peppers, Salmon's a great one as well. Avocado, within reason. Obviously you don't wanna do the avocado too much. And also nuts like Brazil nuts, cashew nuts, really nice pure nuts. Don't get them with too many additives in them. Really look for the pure nuts. They're really great as well. And dark chocolate, because if you're like me, you definitely need some chocolate in your life and dark chocolate is really great for a boost as well. You can also help your body in other ways as well. Now I know it's a lot to take on in one go and huge lifestyle changes aren't easy either. So one step at a time. That's how I started off as well. And I try to put then more rice and lentils and sweet potato into my diet as well, simply because these are slow release carbohydrates and slow release carbohydrates really help your hormones to flow around your body. So imagine if you eat those quick fix carbohydrates, you get a blood sugar high and everything is going crazy in your body. It's putting the hormones out of whack as well. So if you go nice and gentle on your body, you're giving your body an easier time as well. You can also use aromatherapy to support your body and your overall wellness. Aromatherapy is wonderful. I use essential oils in a diffuser and I also put them topically on my body. So that's when you're rolling the oils onto your body. Now it's very, very important here that you have got really pure top quality oils before you put them on your body because you're in a place where you're wanting the best for your body. And so you really need to make sure that you're putting the right things on it as well. So, you know, essential oils are the same as, like compare it to alcohol. You know, if you buy a cheap bottle of alcohol, you're gonna feel rubbish the next day because of what's in it. If you buy a higher quality bottle, you know, it's okay. You probably feel a lot better the next day. I'm not saying drink the whole bottle, but you know, if I make that comparison, what I'm talking about. It's exactly the same with essential oils. There are some cheap ones that you get, which are mixed with all sorts of rubbish and you get the pure quality ones. Yes, they're more expensive, but then you'll know you're putting pure oils on your body or into your household with the diffuser. And I'm talking about one particular oil called Progescence. Progescence is a natural progesterone booster. It's actually made from wild yam extract. Now, wild yams are absolutely amazing as a progesterone booster as well. So if you'd like to know more about the company that I use for essential oils, do just send me a comment or send me a message and I'm really happy to help you out there. Of course, it's your own personal choice, but if you'd like to know who I recommend, then please do reach out to me there as well. 
And thirdly, your stress levels are so, so important. If you're highly stressed, actually your body can react really adversely and it can interrupt your reproductive system and your hormones and create hormone imbalance. So when we're highly stressed, the hormone, stress hormone cortisol gets released in our body. Cortisol can interrupt messages that get sent between our brain and our reproductive system, which can cause all sorts of havoc. So you need to be getting de-stressed as well. How do you get de-stressed? I recommend womb connection. Womb connection is getting you in touch with your inner natural feminine flow because so many of us have become disconnected. We live in a modern world which is driven by the male, the flow of the male. And us women, we live in cycles. We have four cycles within our menstruation cycle. And that means we kind of have those phases where we're feeling full of energy and we'll have other phases where we need our peace and quiet and need to retreat. And this isn't recognised in the 24-hour, always-on-the-go, highly strong society, right? We've lost touch with our inner cycles, but I can help you to get in touch with yours once again through womb connection. Now, there's been links coming up above the top of the video here. All you need to do is click on the link and it will take you to my free guide to womb healing, womb connection. Or you can go to the video description, there's an arrow here or here, and that will open up loads of really supportive information and links as well to really help you on your journey because I know that you can boost your progesterone naturally and using creams and medicines is just creating more havoc in your body because in the long term it's putting you even more out of balance which makes sense to look into the natural alternatives which are available to us. I hope this video has helped you. Please reach out if you have any questions. I'd love to hear from you. All the best for now.